Days after actor Nathan Chasing Horse was arrested and accused of sexually assaulting underage girls in what police are calling a cult called The Circle, a former member of that cult is talking to 8 News Now. Sasha Loftus spoke with her as she detailed her experience. Sasha, join us with a story you'll only see right here on 8 News Now. Yes, Brian, Courtney Ward says she was part of the circle here at the home where Chasing Horse was arrested. Now, she tells me a member who later became her boyfriend took her in when she was 17 and homeless, and things just escalated from there. I was told to, you know, basically treat him like a king. Courtney really Ward a describes what life was like, like living with Nathan Chasing Horse. From day one, I, I was abused uh, verbally, mentally, and physically. She says she belonged to his cult, known as The Circle, for about a year, and even had a baby with another member. Like the ward escaped months ago. She touches on what she remembers, including what were called ceremonies. All the windows would be blacked out you know, and um, you wouldn't be able to see anything. She uh, says in that darkness, flashes. music would play as contact was made with spirits. I started seeing flashing lights, you know, um, and I heard rattling. I even felt something touch me one time. She also claims many were given concentrated forms of marijuana called medicine or Phoenix tears. And in ceremonies, who would come with the girls in a straight line. Ward tells me those girls were chasing horses' wives many of whom investigators believe were forced to have sex with him as minors. She also says she witnessed a member's daughter chosen before she was 12 years old. We were told that she was like uh, different, you know, like she was special. And we, I never understood what that meant. Courtney adds when Chasing Horses helpers tried to trap and threaten her, she got away. And now that she's safe, she hopes her story can help others understand. You just have to trust your gut sometimes because I didn't trust my gut and I should have the whole time. Sasha, hearing from her, just a lot of heavy information there from that interview you conducted. Did she mention to you how much she actually interacted with Nathan Chasing Horse? Brian, she says because she was not Native American, she was not allowed to speak with him directly, but she said he was always quiet and everyone was really expected to treat him, in her words, as, quote, more than human. Now, Courtney says her daughter, who she had while she was part of the circle, is still with family affiliated with Chasing Horse. Very complex story. A lot of layers continue to stay on it, and we'll stay on it on 8newsnow.com.